Previously on Mother 3. Oh god, I'm gonna see Reggae Judge come down. Hey! Here I am to ruin the moment again, bro! Okay, here comes a picture, time to take a snapshot! But I don't use a camera, I use my bongos to play you a sick beat instead. Here I go! Now say Fuzzy Monkey Balls! Uh, Fuzzy Monkey And now back to making memories. The Sneaker Bee! Back with some more Mother 3. When we last left off, we flash forward three years to the future. And now Lucas is, well, he's still a boy, but an older boy, probably in his like early teens or something. And he's not a crybaby anymore. And he's also got ultimate demon power. That's right. He acquired psychic connect powers from uh, one of the Magypsies in a rather awkward scene. So yes, uh, okay, it was just me apparently. No, it's, it, it's, from what I heard you guys say, is, is that it was a scene that was sort of meant to be like, like for, you know, the kids aren't gonna get it or whatever, and you know, but as an adult, you're gonna be kind of like, ah, or something like that. And I, I guess different cultures, right? You know, Japanese maybe it's not that big of a deal, but it was definitely for me like, I don't know, just fucking weird. I, I mean, it's one thing it's like two consenting adults, but when it's like one of them is a young boy and they're like joking about him being like molested by this guy it's like like okay come on come on mother three tone it down a bit that's just that's not that's not cool just a really weird and awkward moment in what has otherwise been a pretty delightful game but that aside i've uh i really have enjoyed this game a lot i'm really enjoying the uh the themes that this this story is going for and i'm, I'm liking how much more character focused uh it is than earthbound was um also, I think the gameplay has just all around been improved. Um, by the way, you guys told me, so uh, money is earned the same way it is last game, uh, and that is through uh, getting it, just like, it, it gets put into the bank and then you pick it up, but it, instead of uh, you getting it from your dad, you get it from, I guess, just somebody, I, I guess. I, I, I kind of sort of hit me afterwards, so I guess that means I should have some money in here already, right? Because in the end, you're not really getting, like, money from your dad for, like, amount of time played, it's based on the number of battles you've been through, right? Ah, yep, there it is. Oh, by the way, you guys told me, so apparently the, uh, the little frog driving the car is actually a bit of a meme in the, uh, the mother community. Oh my god, there's, like, there's even, uh, someone selling plushies, like, full-size plushies of the frog driving the car and t-shirts. <laughs> it's so cute! I actually might get a t-shirt slash plushy because they're just so cute <laughs> yeah i think it might be my favorite iteration of the frog so far too oh the fairy one's pretty funny too help me i can't control myself ah! but anyway yes so we've acquired some new psychic uh, abilities with the life life up healing and pk pk xbox alpha yes the most powerful fucking psychic abilities <laughs> you know what you guys jokes was like okay so you're gonna get a the pk xbox the pk xbox 360 the pk xbox one and the pk xbox one x <laughs> yes the amount of damage it does is based on the the sales of each console that means xbox will do a good amount of damage 360 will do amazing damage xbox one will do okay damage and xbox one x will do shit damage <laughs> okay that's a bit of an assumption on my part but for what i've gathered i, I think the xbox one and X have not been doing nearly as well as like the 360 have. Not necessarily bad, but I think they just don't have enough like exclusives for the system, like Sony has for uh, the PS4. By the way, you guys told me something really funny. So uh, off screen, I actually ended up uh, uh, getting an egg from an enemy. Um, I didn't, I didn't like level up or anything. I just, I, I just before I started the video, I actually ran to an enemy and I got an egg. So yeah, see, I'm, I'm only level 12 still. So. But you guys told me apparently, I sh if, once I get a fresh egg, I should immediately go to a hot spot hot spring what i imagine would happen was like okay i'm probably gonna get like a hard-boiled egg right that'll heal me more nope so i went in and sat it sat there for a bit and you had to sit there for a while even after you'd already healed because i got out before it, it it was still the same but then after a while i actually start hearing a chirping sound and i'm like oh my god i've got a ticket oh my god now it's a full grown chicken it was it was actually an, wow it was actually originally a chick a baby chick and now I waited even longer while I was talking here, and now it's turned to a full-grown chicken. A handsome red crest of burrow with stylish erect tail feathers. The chicken dashed off at a breakneck speed. What the hell? No! Chicken! <laughs> That's so funny. Is there a purpose to it? Shit, I should have held on to it though. I bet I 
I don't know. I could probably do something with it. We can actually hear a chirping sound in the background. You probably could, could hear it while I was uh, talking earlier, too. Probably slowly turn from a cheep cheep to a pop, 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 pop. <laughs> wow. And I think it grow up all the way, too. And it grows up to an old chicken. It lays more eggs and eventually just completely overruns my inventory. It's kind of like Final Fantasy Tactics in those fucking Chocobo. Okay. So we're kind of at the halfway point here to the factory. Which, is that where the band is, too? The DMC band, which you guys, or DCMC band, which you guys also point out, is a parody of, of course, ACDC. Fucking classic, baby. Oh, let's go ahead and head on out. Ah! All right, good. I got multiple enemies. Gives me a chance to try out TK Xbox. Eat shit! Ah! Boom! Oh my god! Whoa! That was really fucking powerful. That's the power of Microsoft, bitch. Whoa! What the fuck? Mushroom dog! No! No thank you! No thank you! They guys actually said that uh, the Rambled Mushroom was uh, an enemy or... Uh, an item or something that shows up in Smash Brothers 2? Does it, did it really? I did not realize. When I'm in the edible mushroom, am I just... Oh, shit. Am I eating the enemy I just killed? A much shroom suddenly attacked. Oh, he's just so happy to see me, aren't you? I'm gonna sniff him. Sniff the dog's butt. It's a biological... Chi oh, bi biological chimera! Oh, okay. Of course. So, the chimera are, again... It's the the pigs doing right because they uh, like they did with the the, me the mechanical caribou and and the mecha drago. So doing with other things like the mushrooms here and a dog and the snakes and the chickens too. I kind of figured anything they were messing with would always be like uh, mechanical or robotic in some way, right? But nope, I'm just mixing all the other kinds of shit together. Smells weak against fire, weak against crying. Boom! This dog has a lot of health. There we go. Oh my god, ah! I'm moonwalking! It's interesting, when you get confused, it, it does come outside of battle, but only for a little bit, and then it goes away. I guess maybe just chirp you up, make you accidentally walk into another enemy. Please don't write graffiti on signs. Like, like hot dog, or dog food. I'm gonna write hot dog. Hot dog! Hot dog! I hot dog! Lucas, you got hot dogs? No, Boney, I don't have hot dogs. Then why did you mention them? Holy mother smashing! I, maybe it's an electric guitar, that's what uh, Lucas's is. Because now he's a fucking savage. That's right. Oh god. Oh! Time for some sparrow advice. Have you ever noticed that you can send weak enemies flying if you dash into them? Feels, feels pretty good, huh? Pretty addicting, huh? Those don't count as real fights, so then it won't net you any so called experience points. Huh? You already knew that. Or are you just pretending to know? You're not pretending, are you? In any case, time to send this in this the sparrow like I can read your brain. Sprinting bomb. Tasmanly to the left, factory to the right. <laughs> Cliff tracks. <laughs> uh, glad to see it. This game has not lost its sense of humor. What the hell is that? Even all the horrible shit that's been happening. Reconstructed mole with some epic music. I'm assuming I can dust her back at some point, right? Since we seem to be uh, talking about him maybe being that bassist. And I'm hoping, just I'm hoping so, because that ability that let him actually hear the beat to these songs is really, it's really helpful, because some of them are really hard to figure out. We are increasing the number of cattle snakes. They're extremely dangerous. If you see one, stay away. View them from a distance only. Chimera Laboratory. Oh, hello, Mr. Cow. Oh, no! What the fuck is that? Oh, that is fucked. Should I? I don't know. I'm a little nervous, actually. Let me just, uh... Oh, yeah. You're not good. Let's talk about a cattle snake. Oh, you're the cat. Yeah, okay. I see. You're the... <laughs> of course! The cattle and the snake. Let's see how much damage I can do on this thing. Smells like a biological chimera. Smells weak against ice! Crying! 
fucking ground. Eh, no, we're not doing much damage. Uh, fuck it, run, run. I don't, I don't trust it. That's not giving me, warn me about it. I feel like he's just, he's just gonna wreck me. Oh God, it's more of these things. Oh, for God's sakes, why can't I not squeeze between these trees? Get out of my way. Get now, damn it. Got a bread roll. Youngsters, here's your chance to sweat beautiful sweat. Part-time help wanted at the factory. All those interested, apply at the factory right this way. Oh, it's the, oh God, it's that fucking fat kid. Oh my God. Ah, they just let these things water the place. I'm talking about how dangerous they are. Ah, there's something really fucked up about this. Like seriously, they're just like splicing genomes and forming these monstrosities. Why? They, what they, they said they were trying to make shit look cooler? Why? That doesn't look cooler, man. That just looks like fucking creepy pasta. Flea powder. Best solution for the flea for flea problems. They're gone before you know it. Oh, I'm guessing that's something only uh, Bony can get. Uh, stats effects? Maybe. If we can get it, then ew. Like this font song can fuck right off. It's got really. It's really fast. I cannot. I just can't get the beat. Oh, I can't stand doing work. I hate it. God, I just want to stand around and be a fat fuck all day. It should be night already. Then I could go to Titty Boo Boo Boy. Guess you wouldn't understand, huh? So you're just a dumb kid. Not doing jack shit. I'm not slacking off at all. Sort of like, you know, keeping an eye out for people who are slacking off. Yeah. What are you smirking about? <laughs> okay, you can't fool me. Come on, man. Uh, 50 DP for a person for fact. For a person for factory workers. For everyone else, the ticket to the crossroads station is. Oh my god, really? Are you factory workers? Yes. <laughs> you're like. You're lying, aren't you? One ticket will be 2,500. No. It's just you walked a task plate. Oh my God. Not, the train's not even here, man. Oh, Lord. All right. Hi, Froggy. Are you working here, too? Curious to see what they're making here. I guess all the technological stuff they've been, uh, that has shown up in the task plate. Oh, hey there, Lucas. Working in the factory isn't easy. We to get free tickets to Club Titty Boo, Boo out of it. This is not all bad. There's a vending machine here. Would you like to use it? Sure. Oh, I can buy stuff. It's beef jerky and a. Uh, oh right, you guys suggested. Um, so apparently, since Boney is the fastest, um, it's probably better to give him all the healing items. That's probably a good idea. And Lucas has already got uh, his healing skills, so I'll give. Uh, Bony something of his own. Hey, brisk soda for the end of a hard day. Uh, oh, it's this guy. I'm friendly on the pause, dude. Okay, well, seeing as you're showing up here, then you must be, you must not be a bad guy. Probably your mate's seriously a real inspiration. Right behind you, support 100% from the sidelines, bro. I, uh, thank you, I guess. I haven't actually done anything yet, though. Got some eye drops. I have to worry about crying here. <laughs> And not just from the fields! Oh, there's Club Titty Boo. And this is the factory en entrance. Yeah, whoa. Oh, there's uh, Isaac. Oh, hey there, Lucas. Are you here at the factory for something? If you feel like working, I'm sure they'll hire you. I'm sure they would. Nothing like child labor. Ah, God. Ah, mutant Gumby. Kill me. Hey, you suspicious fellow. What are you doing? What's that? I want to go to Club Titty Boo Boo. That's a special place for workers here to go and relieve their daily exhaustion. It's not for people who don't work here. If you absolutely have to go there, then it's simple. Just do some part-time work here. What do you say? Are you here for some part-time work? Sure. Yeah? That makes things easy. Job is to transfer claimant. First, go all the way inside. You'll find a ladder there. Go down it. You'll find a bunch of clay men in the area below. Some of them will be almost out of energy, so you gotta bring them back up here. Bring them one at a time. After you brought three up, you're done. Just be safe. I'll give you this sketch of how the factory is laid out. Okie dokie. Oh, and sign your name on this document. No, no, not, not your name. I, the, I mean, you know, the name of... Of the person in the back. <laughs> what? Wow, okay. I, I, I don't understand. I'm talking about the person playing the game we're in. What? We're in a game? Huh? Person's pulling the strings, I, I guess you could say. What I mean to say is, 
<laughs> he just looks at the screen. You, Nick, I'm talking about you. You say the, 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 the player's name. I just need for, for verification purposes. I can do a board. You, you know it is. Anyway, if you can do that, that'd help out a lot. Oh, okay. Is it just give me a chance to change it in case I want to now? Ruska. Great, Nico. Say your correct name. Yes. Nico. All right, got it. On to our records. Now listen, don't do anything bad because that'll only inconvenience Nico. So don't forget that. All right, then. Work hard. <laughs> I don't understand. What do you mean inconvenience? I'm the one in control here. If he fucks up, it means I fucked up. Hold on, dog. Dogs have dog things to keep them busy. Dog! Go on ahead and do what boss dog says. Oh. Oh, no. He's sad. No. Don't be mean to my dog, mister. Playmen low on energy are very weak, so you'll know which ones they are right away. All right. I'll do it. That probably means some of them aren't, right? And they'll... Attack me or something? Oh, what the fuck? How are you guys not disturbed by this? Uh, I'm still alive, fuck. Blue, eh? everyone's working down below. They're digging up clay to make Clayman out of. Oh, uh, these are the two funny guys, right? Was well, that Clayman low on energy here? They start moving again. These machines almost seem to invite you to use them. But you can't touch them. People can, can't touch them or else they'll get zapped with something fierce. I've never touched them, of course. I want to. Ignore the urges. Ignore the urges! Oh. Hey there, Lucas. Did you come to see me? I uh, didn't. I see. How's Flint? Same as always? I see. <laughs> Good talk. Oh! <laughs> no! <laughs> Hi, Darth! Hello! Oh, oh. You do got with the dark first, so annoying! It's like, just shut up and work, will you? God! I'll get paid milk bones and dry food to listen to your ass all day! God! <laughs> woof woof. Uh, uh, woof woof. Uh, it's nice to exercise once in a while. Yeah, we have, I appreciate Ryan getting some good exercise in Pony. Nick! <laughs> oink oink. <laughs> it proceeds, uh, that is also just what he's saying. Alright, time to heal myself in the pig chamber. Ah! Uh, okay, going down, I guess. Oh. Nope, there's a ladder. Ah! Hey, part timer. This is lift to send low energy claimant up to the ground floor. So just bring one here and talk to me. Ah, I see. Hi, bro. Arr. Okay, you're. I guess not low energy. Low energy ones are just just kind of lying down. You doing all right, Ben? Arr. So they make these things to do a whole bunch of manual labor for them. Oh. Oh, this guy's low energy. Oh, I gotta push him, I see. Oh, I feel kinda bad for him. We're going to climb Titty Boo Boo. What's a ropeway behind the factories for? Go straight there by going up the ropeway. Think about climbing up the cliff instead, just forget about it. Oh. Ah, crap. This girl big time broke this clay, man. I'm so fucked. I have to haul this to lift and carry it to the entrance. Yeah, looks like I'm stuck doing overtime today. Stop moving. It's dead. What's the day I just have to finish work? So I go to Club Titty Boo Boo. So I can see Violet in all her hotness. <laughs> oh, it's Thomas! Huh? Is that you, Lucas? Or are you someone else? I never imagined that you, of all people, would ever take the rope weight up to Club T Titty Boo. You are Lucas, right? Well, I see you still got your funny little arm waves when you talk. This factory is different for digging up clay, but I hear it has some other secret purpose. I don't know if it's true or not. They say it's an insanely huge dragon buried underground. So it's he's bigger than this whole island. Yeah, right. You gotta be kidding me. Why are we digging? Is that we want him or something? We want to use Harness's power. Okay, come on, Mr. Clayman. Here we go. Luke is gonna take you back home. We're gonna get you all fixed up. Or maybe get you killed, I'm not sure. One of the, one of the other. Do, 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 do. Can I like run into you? No. Nope, we gotta do this the slow way. Come on, big guy. I'm gonna tuck you into bed. Okay, bro. Ah, dude, get out of my way. Leave my friend alone. 
Okay, come on, big guy. Time to go in. Oh, I brought one already, have you? Hold on a second. Let me die, Lucas. All right, man, here we go. Oh, good look, good work, Lucas. Cause zap him full of energy. And now he is back in full form again. Oh, he's feeling great now. There should be some more, just bring him, bring him on up here. Woo! Two more to go, okay. Ooh, this might take a while though. Oh, oh, there's one. Okay, number two. All right, good work. Just leave it there. We'll hand it, hand it from here. Go get the next one. Okay, one left. Whoa, that one's excited. <laughs> I am so ready. Oh, there he is. Okay, come on, bud. Here we go. Here we are. Oh, good work. That's enough for today. Don't forget to get your pay from Mr. Brown. He's got the entrance. Woo! -hoo! Pay me a DP. Pay me a dragon power. I finished my part-time job. Yay! I'm a working man now. Now for Lucas to learn the harsh reality of minimum wage. Hi there. I did it. Oh, good job today. Here's your reward for a hard day of work. Bony did good too. I got a ticket. And here's your pay for today. <laughs> Woohoo! Work every day can make even more money. I think I make more money from just killing monsters. Yeah, that's another way to that's another way to make a living. Just don't fuck with those cow snakes out there. They will eat you alive. Yeah, okay. Work up against the ways you strive for dreams. You're still young after all. Just remember, you're probably gonna die in this place. It's got really late. Come relax the club titty boo and have a good time. Good job today. All right, let's go, Bunny. Oh, it actually is laid out now. Oh, I didn't have to find anybody. I, I thought for sure I'd have to, like, beat up one of the claymen. Like, one of them would get, like, riled up or out of control and have to take him down before transporting him. The fuck is that? Pig flower? Pigtunia! Why? Why would you do this? Sowed some seeds around itself. Oh, dear. Uh, face the power of PK Xbox. Oh god. Look at this PP. Pee -pee. No! Don't touch my PP. EX Box powers! Oh my god, you're still alive. I can't stop crying, dude! Oh, that's not good. These guys are not dying. Oh, there we go. Woo! Give me a lot of experience, though. Level 14 for both of us. All right, you know what? Let's go. Uh, let's go heal back up again. We're allowed to use the healing pods off the clock, right? Oh, hey. For some reason, Lucas started to feel feverish. Okay, so you guys point out this is actually like a new mechanic in the game. So basically, when this happens, you it, it means you're about to learn a skill. Um, I think I think you guys said all you got to do is just walk around when it happens. It really doesn't have anything to do with like battles or anything. So okay. Oh, you're rolling away. Offense up, Alpha. All right, cool. It's kind of a kind of a bizarre mechanic. I feel like better was just kind of automatic, but I suppose maybe the point is trying to make it a bit more uh, I don't know immersive or realistic or something. I, quote unquote realistic. Oh, and I, I, I meant to say before. So the, what he was actually doing uh, was uh, the the Majipsi was that he was taking uh, Ness, uh, Lucas's head and uh, dunking underwater, kind of like a baptism. So I see. All right, I think I better just ignore those pigs. They're a little too strong. What about that? That thing. Oh, hey, there's a map over there. Ooh, oh wow, I got a big area here. What about Lisa Cup TV? You wanna ride up? Sure. Take us, please. Yes, everything is in order. Please get on. Okay.
It's got a little area that's sort of built around the factory as well, that for all the after work stuff. Well, it looked like there's some. There was even some other like there was like a tower over to the right, and something over to the left. Well, actually, the thing over to the left is probably what this is. Club Titty Boo. Oh, look who's open the present. There was a firework in there! Yay! <laughs> there are fireworks inside! Ah. <laughs> ah. There was exotic butters in there. There were bongos playing. One binocular, one DP. Sure. Oh, yep. There it is. Big old tower. Is that a broadcasting tower or something? Okay, Bonnie, all right. Need to go, Tinky? <laughs> what the heck am I looking at here? It's an elephant with his brain opened up. Gross. Yes, gross. An elephant statue. Is this supposed to be like based on some kind of religion? Uh, maybe more like a, is it like a casino in there too? Whoa there, haven't seen you around here before. We don't allow pets inside. Oh, come on, hasn't Bony been through enough today? Sorry, but I have to ask you to leave. Get him, Bony! <laughs> come back some other time. <laughs> ah! Oh! Sad Lucas, sad Bony. Uh, oh. Come on, I paid a ticket to get up here. Oh my god! Whoa, is that guy got a dog with him just a minute? <laughs> oh my god! Wow! Man, Boney, you really are talented. Look at you. <laughs> He put on an outfit as he walk up to his hind legs, too. Just a minute ago. <laughs> Hi there! And, and, and some dog like dude. But thankfully, it's just a dude. It looks like a dog. No, there's something fishy about this. Where'd that dog from earlier go? Where'd this dog like dude come from? He's my friend, alright? Don't make fun of his appearance. He's very self conscious. I, I am! Don't say mean things about me! Unless you have cookies, in which case you can say whatever you want. And on top of that, you smell underage. I smell underage? Uh, excuse me? You smell like an underage kid and a dog. Now you mention it, this is weird. No such people allowed. That's our rule here. Scram! You lost a kid like dude and dog like dude. No, I said we pulverize him right here. What? What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with these people? My, if it isn't the underage smelling poo and the dog smelling woof. Violet. I take it you two have been mistaken for underage kid and a dog yet again. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Ah, uh, you know these dudes, Violet? I don't know. I still say there's something not right about these guys. This is a dog-like dude here. Shake! Don't look away from me! Shake! Don't do it! Don't listen to him, Bonnie! Bonnie's too smart. See? You do know how to shake. T did he? Did he? <laughs> yes, I do know how to shake, but... <laughs> There's a tail wag I... I didn't see him move or anything. This guy is definitely dog like. But it seems he isn't a dog. No, he didn't do it. Alright. He kept his shit together. <laughs> this is funny with a little hat on. Dude, by chance you are a dog. You'd be one of the best dogs to ever shake. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I thought you said, if you are a dog, you're fucking dead. No, you're one of the best dogs out there, bro. Heh. <laughs> I feel like we've all learned a little something today. Wonderful. Come in, have lots of fun, and forget about all your worries. Okie dokie. Hey, dude. Bro. Have fun. Bye. 
Thank you! Woof woof. I mean, uh... Woof woof. <laughs> that was scary! I know, right? I tinkled a little bit. Me too! My god, I'm not wearing pants! Oh my god, that dog like dude is not wearing any pants! Here we are, big city sodas on Sailor like Club Titty Boo! Let's try one of them, at least once. <laughs> big city soda, so that's currently all the rage. Big city cola, this drink is a hit at Club Titty Boo Boo! Uh, popular hamburger in the big city. Oh my god. 100 HP. French fries with an urban flair. A doggy biscuit! A fair treat among dogs. Heal 60. That's pretty good. Can I can I heal myself with that too? Or just him? Kind of curious. Can I, can I heal myself? I can't! In that case, this one's definitely the best value. Buy a whole bunch of doggy biscuits. It's a slot for money. Is there 10 DP? A big cola came out. We don't have restrooms for dogs here. Oh, you're not a dog? My apologies. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that. Are you a lady? Yes. Is someone in here? No. <laughs> it's the ladies room, you know. I'm gonna take that fire extinguisher. <laughs> Lucas, can we hurry up, please? It's getting harder to walk on two le two legs. Hey, I do it all the time, Pony. All right, you can do it too. You just gotta get used to it. Okay, if you say so. Oh, ha huh? Save your game. I'm taking the shit, man. What do you want? What you want? Fine, I'll save your game, but could you grab me some TP on your way out? Lucas? Lucas! You bitch. Tonagosa! That's the greeting, you know? The greeting! Tonagosa! Should at least learn the DCMC greeting, you know? Hey, how's it going? I got some homemade DCMC merchandise here, right here. It breaks a rip. I'll stay up all night to fix it. No, I'm just kidding. I kid a lot. Whatever. I'm making a chain. But never mind, I buy some of these here DMC goods. DCMC. Pamphlet. Oh, it actually increases my stats. Oh, yeah, defense plus one. Oh, I need a good hat. A pickle veggie plate. Dish of old fashioned pickled vegetables. Ew, it's 10 AP. Only 10 HP, too, because it's disgusting. And bleh. Oh, I, when you start running, he does actually drop down all four legs. Oh, I can't pick up any money from him. Ah, damn it. Uh, staff only. Oh, would you see a giggle at the end of everything they say? I really wish they get rid of that rule, though. It's so stupid. <laughs> ah! Listen, but don't change the expression on your face. I know I'm dressed in this crappy girly outfit, but- Oh! Oh, but it's me, Kobatora! Oh! Oh, of course it is. I should probably immediately notice that. Your hair color was the same, and you had the same- Well, I guess all the Earthbound people have kind of that same face, except for Big Mouth Lady, but- But still. It's me, Kobatora! Wait at the Sunshine Forest, remember? I'll explain everything later. Put a smile on, will you? Okay, good. Okay. Next TCM car song is about to begin. Just go on in and find some empty seats. Ha ha! Play House Bells! We're back in black! Yeah, dude! What the fuck is that, a Minotaur over there? Okay, seriously, my high legs are kidding me, Lucas! We love you, Magic! I love you, Magic! Bakayo! Bakayo! OJ Simpson! Woo! <laughs> Juice! Z Miz, you're the greatest! In the house! Yeah, lucky! Everyone is really fucking pumped. Wow, you're really late. The DCMC concert's already over. Choo choo! <laughs> I mean, giggle, giggle. Everyone's just waiting for the encore now. <laughs> Tanagasa! Am I lying size that girl who's always at the beach? She's staring at me like she really likes me. I'm starting to think that I could like her too. <laughs> oh, it's these guys again. Oh, by the way, you also guys, you guys also point out the doorknob that was mentioned before. Best thing, best stealing a doorknob was a reference to Flint and the doorknob that. Uh, uh, fell off the door there, and apparently that actually is a bit of a running gag in this entire game According to you guys, so it's kind of like what I was thinking with uh, the the mouse from before like showing up for like the remainder of the game Don't go so my line of sight the always the beach is doing me like he really likes me. I think I like him too. Woo! Oh my god I ship those two so hard now Man, Suppose there's just one guy who makes the whole world go round. No, actually I'm not sure if it's a guy or not I guess it could be a woman or even a kid like you! Hopefully, oh, of course, starts soon. 
Oh, and after each concert, one of the girls here gives even gives out free DMC pamphlets. Lucky the bass player definitely looks a lot like Duster. But I don't know, it's like different about him. Can't quit with my finger on it. My god, look at this motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, what do you want? <laughs> Smell like a dog. Like a dog and a kid. This ain't no place for dogs smelling kids to come. Better watch still, boy. Uh, okay. Is Papa Squad here or something? Sure, as he's belonged to us. Stay away from here, you have some nerve. My god. Ew, you have some hairy, such a hairy face. Yeah. Shut up. I'm just the way God made me. Uh, where do I sit exactly? I just try to walk out or something? Uh, yep, there we go. Huh? This is in the restroom? Uh oh. Ah! Oh, is this is in the dressing room? Ah! Oh, I messed up again. Ah! Ah! Watch where you're walking! You got ketchup all over my clothes! Oh man, thanks a lot. You suck. Ah! Oh, sir, pardon me. Would you like a bag of big, big city fries? It's only 40 DP. I'm good. No, it's too bad, but please try some damn, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, huh? This is the restroom again? Damn it! <laughs> oh my god, it's so good. Yo, where the fuck am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to sit down somewhere, right? Oh, I gotta find an empty table, so this one? Oh, I gotta talk to, I haven't talked to these guys yet. Is this girl and guy over there? I thought for sure he was our head honcho, but apparently there were people way higher up on the ladder than him. I've been wondering about for a while now. Be no lucky, the bass player? I tell him he has to be a wig. Ha! <laughs> okay, I now officially talk to everybody. Come on. Oh, well, of course, we'll start if we keep walking around like this. Let's go sit down, okay? Yes! I've been trying to do that! You know, there aren't any seats at this table. Well, walking like this is exhausting! Huh. Oh, there's Thomas. His crazy legs. Hey there! What would you like to drink, sir? Giggle! I can't laugh, so I just say the word giggle. Don't tell my boss. You want? Water? <laughs> oh, hey there, Lucas. I was wondering who in the world would order water in a place like this. Dude, get, get, dude live a little, alright? I want to get fucked up. I mean, come on, water. <laughs> hey, Violet, baby. Come over here and shake those titties of yours in my face. What is this up for this here boy? And a big city coma for his dog like friend. Oh, man, yeah. Gonna get but it's on me, the great Thomas, of course. I'm a god in this world. Certainly, sir. One fizzy soda, instead of water, and one big city cola. Coming right up. Giggle. Oh, I never thought I'd see you here, Lucas. I thought you hated this place. I do. Here, all gentlemen. Shh, listen, don't change the expression on your face. There's a line to talk to you about after the DCMC cost is over. After it's over, don't leave. Hang out in the lobby. I'll be there to get you. Alright, see you later. You idiot! Idiot, don't change your expression! I, I didn't. This is just how I look all the time. Well, enjoy yourselves! Giggle! Hey, Lucas! Come on, man! What were you and Violet talking about, bro? Oh my god, getting some serious pause, bro! Thomas, I'm only like 14. Yeah, man, gonna get laid tonight! Yeah, bro! What happened to you, man? You used to be cool. Well, actually, maybe not cool, but... You were... Less of a douche. Remember, you were such a ladies' man. Oh my god, it's... It's starting! I'm so ready! Ah, uh, yep, there he is. To the guy to the left. Darling Gossip! Are you enjoying the show? <laughs> oh my pork! <laughs> Looks like our time is up, sad to say. So here's one last song for you. Here's King P's theme. <laughs> it's funny how the last game also had a uh, a band, right? It seemed like there are bands in these games. That was... Was it the, was it the runway 5 or 4 or something? Yeah, oh. 
Oh, say, can you see by dawn's early light? Girl, I'm gonna rock you in Freedom Town tonight. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. House bells! <laughs> Oh, pelvic thrust. Ugh. Oh, damn it. This video is gonna get so flagged. <laughs> Fun copyright music, guys. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Peace theme. Or is that a reference to something or somebody? This song actually does sound familiar. May have heard this in Smash Brothers. <laughs> I saw his wig go, go off there a second for a second. Also funny that he's actually playing the literal bass. I thought he meant like bass guitar. Nope, he's playing a big fucking bass. Woof woof. My ears are ringing. Hey Lucas! Look at me, I'm over here! Lucas! Lucas! <laughs> what are you finally talking about? I mean you just met for the first time, right? Man, you're good! Pound it! Pound it, brother! Uh, what? Pound? What is that? Pound it, bro! Ah, uh, don't hit me! Where's everyone in the DMCs lost their memory? DM- What? DCMCs? Oh, uh, okay. Oh, my pork! What if all the trains have stopped running for, for today and I can't get back home? Guess I'll go ahead and my big city- city cola. Mmm, yeah. Well, that DCMC show just great. It was so full of soul. Choo choo. Oh, I see. She's actually eating a thing of food. Oh, so DC MC Pamela souvenirs. Your favorite is a clay titty boo, titty boo. We're popular with our fans. We scored stuff some nice swag, bro. Cool. I think it's actually something I equip too, isn't it? It is. Oh, I can actually use it as a weapon, but not very good. Enough. Oh, effective against DC MC fans. Oh, uh, which means I'm gonna fight those assholes, aren't I? Fortunately, Bony cannot equip it, so I guess I'll put it on myself. Because I think we're going to be having to fight our way out of here. So I told you so. Lucky the bass player's way started to come off during the Tonic Gossa. Man, the DCMC are always so awesome. No matter how times I hear them. Tonic Gossa, Tonic Gossa. This way, this way. The Kumotora got a bit taller since I last saw her. Oh. It's a secret path on the floor. Come on, hurry up. This way. I'm going this way. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Bony got a major luck. It's a saltwater gun, but I can't. I can hold it. Tricks an enemy into turning around. Saltwater gun causes metal to rust, damages mechanical enemies. Ah, nice. Let's talk about a slimy slug. Why am I still wearing this outfit? Oh, dear. Sicker pass is handy, but I always cover the mud every time I can use it. I trash that stick of junk for all those slugs. I'm gonna hop in the shower real quick. So just relax here. Don't you peek. I'm coming in. Somewhere or another, I wound up with this fancy room. Anyways, go shower, you two. There's even a hot spring in there. That's, that's more your thing. We'll talk afterwards. Okay. After showering, the three conversed at great length, almost as if filling in th the three-year gap that has separated them. They discussed the rescued monkey. Oh yeah, where's where's Salsa? They discussed the hummingbird egg from Moso Castle and how it went missing. They discussed the fact that one of the DCMC band members appears to be an amnesic duster. And they discussed the mysterious army that had radically transformed Tasmali Village. So assembling the jumbled pieces of a jigsaw puzzle, they told each other what they knew to put their thoughts together. 
The coming battle will not be easily easy. This more than anything they knew all too demon well. I want to be stronger. It was around that th this time that Lucas truly began to have such feelings. I want to be in a Smash game. And so it would be. Is that the end of this chapter? Nope. That's how I finally managed to sneak myself in here. But we'll never find out what happened to the Humber egg until Duster regains his memory. At this rate, there's no telling when the pigs will get their hands on it. Lucas, see Duster and try talking to him. Maybe he'll remember something if he sees you too. There are gods I sight. They're not exactly bad guys, but I won't risk making things more complicated. Oh! I'm a ladder and go through the attic. Yeah, you've got a lot of secret passages in here. I got a long lunch break, what can I say? You get to the Duster's room from there. It's not the most direct way to get in there, but you're less likely to get caught. I got the DCMC members together. And explain the situation to them, too. See you in a bit. Okay, come on, Boney. Time to chillax again. Ooh! I'm gonna heat up my doggy biscuits! I didn't even bother taking my clothes off. This is like a reverse thing. Normally, I'm always naked, but when I get in the hot tub, I put my clothes back on. Shower, <laughs> A shower so strong that it actually hurts. Ah! Hey, what are you doing in my room, mister? You ain't got much money this cost me a night? It's worth more than your life. Get the crap out of here. I'm getting a girl frog coming over here later. Open the door, it's froppy. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> kiro, kiro. Squeak, squeak. I so greedy, I'd love to collect things. Would you like to buy some mine? Sure. Oh my god, he's got a better stick. And a pencil rocket. A missile shaped like a pencil. Deals explosive damage to all enemies. Bug spray. Made you look. Better stick. All right, let's go find Duster. Oh god, spiders. An arachnid! <laughs> it's gonna block the way. Not time for you. Eat PKA Xbox. Ah, uh, no. Boom! Oh, got a map over there. <laughs> and the item guy. Attic guide. I see, okay, so we got a little past this. There's an area that looks like with a sign to the right there, but it doesn't look like you can get to it. Unless there's like a secret passage from a different angle. It says I can't actually go this way. Oh, maybe the... Wait, I don't know. What are the, what's the difference between a blue door and a... Not blue one. Yo, electric car, guitar over there. And a greedier mouse. Magic tart. Ooh, looks like it's an angry cello over there. Hand it out. So say it's gonna get a little confusing. See, just Lucas like peculiar cheese? Yes, Lucas loves cheese! <laughs> Yummy! Oh, we got a bat. Elder bat. Oh, some epic music too. There we go, got that beat. So it's hard to tell if it's like if it's going the fast beat or the slow one. That one was the slow one. Oh, interesting. If raise one allies offense, effective when stacked. That means the more I do it, the, the stronger it gets. Oh, that guitar wants to kill me. Shit. A gently weeping guitar. <laughs> Oh goodness gracious, great balls of fire, I'm dead. Ah, I'm fucking dead. Hey, I got, I got the beef for this one too. Oh crap. Gotcha! So with this body numb, he still was able to attack. Thought man he was like basically paralyzed. Is there nothing over here? Wow, really? There's no point of coming over here, pretty much. Ah, god damn it, really? Why did I find this dumb guitar then? Does Pony like cheese? Hey, <laughs> not too fond of it. But me love doggy biscuits! Ah, the drum attacks. The beaten drum. I hear the beat there. System beat drum, change the mood in the air. Oh, now it's going faster.
Yeah! Hell yeah. Uh, ow, ow. What? Uh, oh, hey. Squeak, squeak, squeak! Oh, Alfie! It's been doggies! It's been doggies, China! Uh, it's, it's been doggies on, on the rabbit us! As, as, as some more bees, is it? Is that? It, eh, that's Calvin. Dale, Pop, ain't using the box. But Mom's the dicky boy. I got some killer cheese. What the fuck? Squeak, squeak! We've been waiting to put it on time, and I'm all the way with you and Autumn, you double on. Double up! What the fuck? What kind of street ass mice are these? Squeak, eh? Is it what? Is that you, Alfie? <laughs> I think, I was thinking that the, that bony's Alfie. I guess. Or, or me. I, I don't know. Oh, you've been what? See the dicky bird? You did, didn't come by your New Year's Eve crocodile that night? So you crying on and on but all jacked up. What do you want? You put some bleeding ass commodity. Eh? And some of them dump bread for you. Oh, good. Nut bread. Squeak, squeak. What's showing you, Jimmy? and am the butter. What? Me not know either. Some nice stuff was inside. You ate it right away. Something warm inside your heart. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? I had that happen before. Some rice stuff was inside. You ate it right here. You're fully revitalized. Damn it. <laughs> I just used a bunch of time to steal myself. Some nice rice stuff was inside. You ate it right, away, right here. All right. Then we're coming up on a boss. Which looks to be that cello thing. Magic gelatin. Okay. So we're finding Mr. Cello here. As you can plainly see, I am a wooden bass. Or bass. <laughs> but I am still in my prime. But ever since the bass below showed up, I've been left to run this moldy smelling attic. It makes me mad! I feel with so much frustration. I'm gonna turn this frustration to violence. Take my stress out on you guys. You're gonna be bawling your eyes out! Oh boy. Oh no, not. Oh god. Jealous base and his cohort suddenly attack. Not today. Time to offense up. Sniff him. Hmm. Strange smells like strange creatures. We can get fire. But I don't have fire. Guess you fucked. Boom. Oh, give me that offense. It's a jam session attack. No, ah. God damn! I am getting fu- oh, I'm dead. Jesus Christ! That was kind of insane. Oh my god, this fucking shit, are you kidding me? Well, I killed that thing at least. Unfortunately, Boney's dead. Screw this, eat PK Xbox. I'm just gonna blow you all up with fucking magic. And Boney's just gonna guard. Please hit Boney. Doesn't seem like it's really resisting very much. Dead. The drum has a fucking lot of health. Boom. Yes, okay. Now for this asshole. Who doesn't call any more guys? Bammy's feet caused the jealous base to fly into a rage. Oh god. Oh, fuck me. Ah, come on. Aw, oh, man. Shit. You've gotta be kidding me. Fuck this guy. Come on. Oh, there we go. Gotcha, bitch. Oh, thank God. Man, that was a tough one. 30, oh, yeah. 1,352 experience. Level 18. And level 18. That's right. Fuck right off. Thank you. It's all here. Looks like you can jump down from it. Yes, please. Get me the crap out of this area. <laughs> Yoink! What took you so long? Uh, you don't want to know. Anyways, I was first explaining everything to the band members. 
Oh man, what to do? Shimizy Miz. Who? We're discussing things right now. Magic. Tonagasa, you're the one trying to run off with Lucky. Woof woof. Why am I thirsty? Oh god, the base is back. Oh wait, never mind. But apparently, all objects are sentient. That's what you need to remember, guys. Everything. Tonagasa, go, sir. Who are you? He's the one I was talking about just now, Duster. You two know each other. D Duster? It's true that I don't remember even my real name. But, but I've lived my life as Lucky for years years now. Okay. Alright, Lucky. Hey, Das, but could you tell him everything you remember, too? Y yeah, uh, alright. I can definitely tell something very important is taking place here. I had absolutely no memory whatsoever from before I came to Cl Club Titty Boo. I had no idea who I was, where I came from, or where I was going. But for some reason, I was clutching a strange egg with care. I didn't know where I was going, yet I continued to walk desperately. All I knew was that the egg was really important for some reason, and I knew I had to keep it safe. So I looked for a place to hide it. And then, after walking and walking, I buried the egg inside a big dirt clod in a valley where I knew no one would ever find it. I still know where it is, haven't forgotten. You go up a cliff near a giant waterfall and... Unknown oh, Valley! That's it, Duster! The egg we all work so hard to protect is there! Let's go there right now! But am I really Duster? If I am this Duster person, then that means I'll have to leave the band, right? Duster, you're lucky. One of them will cease to exist after today, right? If it turns out I'm Duster, what happens to the DCMC? But if I continue to live as lucky, then what's that egg thing all about? What should I do? I just can't decide. Of course you can. All you do is, all you can do is ask Destiny. Yeah, if Destiny decides it, I'll say goodbye to you with a smile on my face. Destiny, huh? Yeah, let's ask Destiny. We have a way. Same thing we've always done whenever we weren't sure what to do. This is Stone She Clippers, huh? What? Yep. This Lucas fellow will play Stone Sheet Clippers with us. If he beats all five of us in a row, you'll go. Oh! But if he loses even once, you'll stay in DMC and keep on playing the bass. How's that sound? F five in a row, huh? Uh, I'm, I'm cool with that. You there. You're okay with that, right? Okay, well, we're ready to begin when you are. We can start with any one of us. Wanna fight you or something? Whenever me, Magic, and Bakyo play Stone Sheet Clippers, we always end in a tie. Let me be the last one to go. After all, I am the band leader, okay? For the most part, everyone always does specific first move when playing this game. It explains why Bakyo loses to Magic. You ready to go? Oh, Starfield Feverish. Okay, better walk around some. Okay. Learn life up beat beta. Defense up. All right, good. That's probably gonna be useful for this. Bakia always loses to magic, so all right. Shimmy almost always starts with stone. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, no, I'm not. I'm not actually battling them. I'm like Bakia always loses to magic. Ready to go? All right. Stone she clippers. I lose. Luck is with you. Wait. Okay. I. It's impossible. Like impossible to lose anyway. I see. Okay. Stone she. I. I. I get it now. Like, rock paper scissors. Stone sheet clippers! Uh... Paper. Gah! We'll complain, you win. Okay. Oh no, Shimmy always starts with stone. Yep. I lose. I lose with pizzazz! Okay. You're ready to go. Specify win. No, I I'll leave that up to destiny. Stone sheet paper clips! Oh, again, stone sheet paper clips! Rock. Okay, so they always do the same one. Looks like I lose. Guess Destiny's telling me to lose. 
Ready? Yes, I am ready. If I win this, Lucky will stay in the DMC. If you win, Lucky will go with you. Lucky, you cool with that? I want to trust in destiny. If it's my destiny to go, then I'm sure he'll win. If it's not my destiny, he'll lose and I'll stay here. It's as simple as that. Okay then, Lucas, do clippers. I'm going to do sheet. Tona Gosa! Alright, here we go! Stone sheet clippers! Ty, huh? Oh, oh, okay. He, I thought he was gonna lie to me. Set go! Set go! <laughs> we even have voicing for that one. I see. So this is destiny. Guess Lucky probably is this duster guy after all. <laughs> oh, that was nice. So yeah, he went after. I thought I thought he was lying to me, so I, I went. I, I, was, I thought he was gonna end up doing rock while I did scissors. So I did paper instead, but... Go. Don't worry about anything else at all. We just hit the egg in Unknown Valley. Which means I have no reason to stay here anymore, either. Gotta take this goofy get-up off. I right, time to get out of these girl clothes. Thanks for everything, guys. Take care now. Gotta lose the wig, though, Duster. Duster. I'm awake, damn it! Lucky. No, Duster, I guess. You're the greatest bass player ever. I'm gonna miss you, man. Ah. I hope we meet again someday. I'm sure we will. Don't go forgetting the time you spent with us now, you dig. Lucky. Hi, Duster. Hi, Lucas. I still don't remember anything, but I'll come with you guys anyway. Okay, let's go. Hopefully we'll recover some memories on our journey then. Duster joined your party. But I'm keeping the wig. <laughs> okay, that's all right. I understand. Hey, you're level 18 too. Great. Oh, that's cool. He's got DMC boxers. Chip Ban. <laughs> that's a new one. And he's still got the durable shoes. Okay, I have a feeling I'm be this is probably where I'm going to be fighting those, uh, the fans, right? So I'll put on that pamphlet. All right, guys. This seems like a good place to end things here for now. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite. And subscribe if you're not ready to become a Peaky Penguin. Or this will be. Where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. As always, guys, till next time, stay classy!